In this video, I'm going to show you how to duplicate a key scan or Farpoint data remote to a self-learning remote vCell. Uh, the Farpoint data remotes uh, have, are also rebranded to other brands. Uh, some installers or resellers put their own brands on the remote, such as Mercon, RBH Access, uh, Kasek, and uh, many others. Some of the remotes are also come with two buttons. Please note, we only duplicate uh, the remote part. If you want the uh, tab part to get copied, for example, tab to access the door, uh, you, you need to purchase a fob. We can duplicate this to a fob by using the serial number on the back. So for example, this is the serial number, and this one also comes with a serial number. There are three steps to duplicate the remote. Uh, the first step is to put the uh, self-learning remote into the learning mode. The second step is to learn the code. And the third step is to press the desired button you want the original button to be programmed to. In this example, I'm going to demonstrate copying the first button to this button. And you can do the same steps to copy other buttons to other buttons. Uh, or you can copy like two remotes to just one remote if you need to access multiple buildings and uh, because most of the buildings they only use one or two buttons. To put the self-learning remote in the learning mode, you need to press and hold the fourth button and uh, then press the first button four times. One, two, three, four. Now it's in learning mode and you just need to press uh, the button on the original remote the original remote needs to be away from the self-learning remote for about uh, 3 feet or 1 meter. I'm going to keep pressing it. Now we can see the light flashing that indicates it learned the code and press this button. Then as I mentioned, you can repeat the same step and you can program other buttons if necessary.